I didn't have children because I felt that I was so ugly that if I gave birth to anything, that child would just be, you know, like a sort of a hideous monster and something that shouldn't have happened. It's like me telling myself that I'm ugly all the time. Like my brain just sort of working overtime, telling me all the things that are wrong. Disgusting I am, absolutely disgusting. I am. If she's going for a really bad episode, it's almost like she's trying to push you away. Through the years of being with her when she's got like this, I've just learned to not react, just don't do anything. I think Leanne looks beautiful, whatever. Like, I don't see anything wrong with Leanne, but she hates me for saying that. For the last two years, the love life's pretty much been non-existent, which naturally is gonna drive you apart. It took me a long time to get into my first relationship. I didn't have my first proper relationship until I was about 20. I was just too scared. You know, there was people that I fancied. There's people I even suspected fancied me, you know? But the fear of rejection was just off the scale. The weird thing about BDD is that the fact that they're with you seems to prove that you must look okay, that you must be at least normal. You've opened yourself up to this person and there's this fear that one day they're just gonna wake up and realize how horrible you are. Like, I imagine that every single morning that they would wake up and just go, my God, what have I done? Shouldn't be allowed outside. Normal faces, mine's like, like almost deformed. I hate it, I just hate it. Sometimes I just wanna scratch it off. I wanted to go back again to have a think about what was happening in your life when you first started to experience that feeling of being humiliated, rejected, put down. Those memories had a lot of power, didn't they? Yeah. It's hard when you see something to think that other people don't see that. It's either I'm seeing things that everybody else is seeing and everybody's lying, or there's a psychological problem and I'm focusing on different things than what everyone else is focusing on. What if they teach me all this? I understand all the thought processes, but what if I can't get past that negative image? What do I do?